the circle of healing is to raise awareness about uh, our native community and the struggles we've been through was to raise awareness in the non-native community so they could understand us better. I think the bottom line for me is, is to feel welcome in our community and to feel that as a community member that I have something to offer, but as a neighbor that you know we're all we're all here together. The circle of healing uh, means a lot of different things to a lot of the different people that sit around the circle. What are the ways that we could make our community more welcoming to the Native American population? And that's kind of where I started with it. When you think about Native people in this region, you know, you don't really, uh, people don't really know a, a full story about our people. And we all started talking about how can we uh, change things, how can we uh, be effective and communicating and educating and getting more people involved. So the uh, the people that are that need to know the most are are picking up on how we feel. Through these conversations, we're all we're all learning, and I always feel for myself that we're all learning. And so for those people who are willing to delve in and make a commitment, we have several people that can only come once in a while, but they can keep up on our initiatives and help in the, any way that they can. This group has been successful in what they have set out to do. And by, by doing that, they've shown by example that a lot of things are possible that a lot of people don't think about. And, and that is that celebrating our successes and feeling that we are uh, making a difference has been and once you get started, that, that's what keeps us going. The reason I do what I do is because I want my grandkids and my sons and daughters, I want it to be a better place for them.